Angela Dee and it's been a long time. If you are new here, I'm a single millennial foster mom in Los Angeles to two little boys, Buster who is now 21 months and Dash who is 10 months and they are growing like weeds. It's been a long time, lots of things going on personally, professionally, just getting things in order. So I haven't posted because I edit all of my vlogs, all of my content um, and I have just been wanting a hiatus, so I took a hiatus, but we're back now. Um, the good news is while I was on this tiny hiatus, I actually was still shooting stuff, still shooting content. So there's a lot of catching up I have to do, some trips we went on, some cool adventures we've gone on, um, but I thought I'd just pop in and give you a little update on the boys before I go back and upload all the previous stuff. So we're into November, 2021 now. Um, Buster is 21 months, so he'll be two coming up in February, can't believe it. Um, he is the happy-go-lucky little boy he's always been. He's also very opinionated still. He loves talking, he loves playing, jumping off of everything he can. Um, both things that I want him to jump off of and things that I don't want him to jump off of. Um, and then he eats everything still. He's a little um, bottomless pit. Although he's still tiny, he's 30th percentile for weight, 15th for height. So he's on the charts, which was very different for the first from the first year of his life when he wasn't even on the charts. Um, he still loves Little Blue Truck and all the books behind me, as you can see. It's it used to be in some sort of order, but now Dashy's big enough to pull them off too. So Buster and Dash are constantly pulling those books off the shelf. But he still very much loves reading um, and exploring literature. He also is starting to get into some television. Um, I don't have a television set up. I've had one in my living room since last Black Friday, uh, but never got around to setting it up. But we do watch some things on the computer, and he loves the movie Moana. Um, he loves the movie Raya and The Last Dragon and Coco. Those are his three faves. Um, so yeah, those, I mean, we also have like, there's this show on Amazon that I used to watch with my former nanny kids called Truck Tunes. It's on Amazon Prime and it's these really corny songs that I think a Canadian company made up to like different types of trucks, like monster trucks and bulldozers and things. And he really, he really loves those. Um, he still loves Cupcake the Dog, who you've probably seen on our Insta. Check it out if you haven't, at Angela D Vlogs and our Facebook, same name. Um, he loves his brother. He does love his brother. <laughs> it's getting to the part where Dash is more mobile and interested in picking things up. And some of those things Buster wants, but he doesn't know he wants them until Dash wants them. Uh, so Buster's learning to take turns. When he snatches things out of Dash's hand, Dash is really just chill about it. He's like, all right, I'll go find something else. But that will not always be. So right now we're trying to work on taking turns and not snatching from brother. Um, and finding finding something else to entertain him while brother plays with the toy that he eventually wants. So what else? So his case has moved along. There's been a big change in his case. Um, but I don't think we're ready to talk about it yet. So we're going to wait a little while longer. Um, my close friends and family do know um, what's going down. But uh, just to say through Christmas and thereafter, Buster will be with me. I'll give you bigger updates when we're ready to talk about it. And Dashie's case, unfortunately, is still stalled for a number of reasons, which we won't share because I don't usually talk about their cases on here, but um, his next hearing isn't until 2022. So no updates on Dashie for real. Um, but speaking of this 10-month-old butterball, Dash is now 91st percentile for weight, 85th for height. So he is a big, solid man. He actually weighs just about the same as Buster. They're about 23 pounds. <laughs> but Dash feels heavier because I think he's more compact. He's about three inches shorter, two or three inches shorter, and just solid. He loves to eat, um, but he has some texture uh, aversions. Maybe not aversions, but like Buster, when he was his age, would just shovel it all in. Didn't matter the texture. He loved it. He wanted to eat it. Boom. Dashy, he gets a little um, apprehensive with the way some things have a mouthfeel, like broccoli, which Buster eventually had like a little bit of an aversion to, like the tree part of the broccoli. Um, and then some meats, he doesn't love the feel of it in his mouth. So he'll just put his fingers in, <laughs> pull it out, and throw it on the floor. Thank you, Dashy. Um, but otherwise, he's still loving food. Um, and pretty much any flavor he's down for. If he sees somebody eating, he will hightail it over to them and try to eat what he what they are eating. Um, Dash, he's been crawling. He does a bear crawl where he walks on his feet and his hands. So that's interesting, but he's also cruising on things. He took a little hesitant step to me a couple days ago, but I'm not counting that because I don't think it was intentional. I think he was just distracted. Um, but he can, like, if he's in the middle of the floor and there's nothing for him to pull up on, he can still stand up, which is 
amazing to me. Um, and he's um, 10 and a half months, but I'm pretty sure he's going to be walking soon. Buster walked when he was 11 months. So I think Dash is right on track to hit that 11 month walking um, uh, milestone. Same as Bust. Um, what else about Dashie is still, he's very giggly. Um, when he's entertained, which is to say most of the time at daycare, because those children are very entertaining, or when we visit friends and family, he's so chill. He just is taken in the world, looking around. If he's at home and he's bored, he will let you know that he is bored. And um, even though he has a brother to entertain him, but sometimes that brother is taking toys away from him that he would like to play with. So I guess I can't count on his brother to entertain him all the time. But uh, Dashy, in general, is still a very chill little guy. Um, very, very cuddly and very snuggly. Um, he tries to give open mouth kisses and, you know, normal 10 month old stuff. He has really gotten into books. He eats them more than Buster did, but he still likes to read them. And the other day I caught him, I tried to get it on camera, but I couldn't. And he was like tap, tap, tapping on the book going dot, 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 dot. And I was like, oh, you're reading. That's so precious. Um, so yeah, uh, I'll, uh, I think for the header of this, I'm going to put a picture of them in their Halloween costumes. Dashie wore Buster's costume from last year, which was gifted to us. It's a Pottery Barn astronaut costume. And then I bought a new Pottery Barn astronaut costume for Buster. Um, it was on sale because it was just a couple days before Halloween. And they went trick-or-treating for the first time. We went with my old nanny kids. They love those girls. There's three of them. And that was super fun. And I ate most of his candy. But I did give him some. I gave him the non-choking hazards. Like I gave him M&M's and a Reese's cup. And uh, I still have a bag of M&M's that I keep telling myself not to eat because they belong to him and he can actually eat those. And I ate all the other candy. So, so that bag is still around. Oh, and then like Jolly Ranchers and like hard candy that I'm not a huge fan of, but don't want to give to him because he's a baby. So yeah, we've been on a lot of like fun, short, adventures and I've recorded most of them so I'm not going to say which I recorded because I think I lost a memory card sadly so I don't know what was on that one but I'll find it hopefully until then there's plenty of other stuff to edit this quick update is just that a quick update so I'm going to close it out here but please if you haven't subscribed go ahead and click that button down there it shows us that you're watching and that you're interested I'm going to try my hardest to post regularly from now on and I uh, can't wait to share more of our journey with you hope you're having a good day bye